Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Chanel and we're here with another reaction video. How y'all think I think I miss me because I miss y'all. But anyway, I hope y'all have already liked and subscribed to my channel. I have been seeing y'all comment. I definitely appreciate the growth that we have since the first beginning of me being a YouTuber. So definitely thank y'all to my supporters. All right, so the first video we have today is Woman Reveals the 30 Lies Women Tell to Men. Girl, why, girl, now listen, I don't want no woman mad when the guys figure this stuff out, okay? Because she over here snitching. I don't know what she said, even she said yet, but I'm just saying, don't get mad. You don't see the bros breaking the bro code with they, with they stuff, and here you go wanting to tell something. All right, so let's see. Let's see what she, what supposedly we lying about. I'm about to reveal the common lies women are hardwired to tell you and what they really mean. Number one, he's just a friend. She knows he wants her, but she's friends on him and only keeps him around and close to her for her benefit. Number two, I'm not. That happens. And I'm going to be the type of female to say it ain't, okay? That happens. Oh, that happens. And and men, I'm sure y'all know better by now with this whole friend shit. Okay, I don't I don't condone the whole friend thing in a relationship. Let that shit go. What you need to want to say anyway for? Crazy. Here's a fact. Only crazy people say this. <laughs> Number three. Oh, I missed I really, it. She she talks so friend. damn fast. She knows he wants her, but she's friends on him and only keeps him around and close to her for her benefit. Number two. I'm not crazy. Here's a fact. Only crazy people say this. <laughs> Number three. I really like. That's a fact. We're not not all of us. Listen, we ain't crazy. We may have a moment. I might be a little biased on this one. <laughs> we may have a moment, but yeah, not not crazy. Maybe a little insecure. Maybe a little jealous. Maybe a little envious. But I wouldn't say crazy. You, but as a friend, it almost always means that she's trying to reject you politely. Number four, nothing's fair. wrong. I'm fine. Literally, almost never true. <laughs> That is a, that's a fact. A clear fact. That's when you got to read the room and body language. Sometimes we just, well, we just don't want to address it right then. Or we don't want to make it a big problem right then. We will definitely say that. So, that is a fact. Number five, you're the best I've ever had. She's trying to stroke your ego to make sure that you stay confident in the bedroom. Number five, sorry I didn't see your... She could be telling the truth. How you going to tell that girl that... She, how you going to... Girl, shut up. How you gonna say that? Now, I'm not saying it don't happen. I'm just saying. How you gonna really know? Oh, I don't do something. In the bedroom. Number five. Sorry, I didn't see your text. She did. She just purposely ignored you. That's, that's not a lie. It's been times where I really have not seen a text. Okay? So... But then there's times where I have. I ain't gonna lie to that either. So it just depends on the situation. I don't know if she's if she's for, you know, just for a single female. Because, I mean, I'm not even about to say I ain't see your text. If I'm single, I just ain't text back. Because I'm grown. I can do that. I respond on oh, respond. Six, I'm not like all those other girls. If she says this, she's exactly like all those other girls. Yeah. Number seven, I'm not looking for a relationship. That means I'm not looking for a relationship with you. Number eight, I can... Facts. Facts. You just don't want to hurt your feelings, you know. But then, 10 times out of 10, you might see her a month later with somebody. It's like, well, what happened? What happened? It is she didn't want to hurt your feelings. That's a fact. Or marry a man for money. For the right price, she can. A man can handle not living how they want to better than a woman can because men are builders and women are nurturers. Number nine, it's okay. I forgive you. Women don't forgive anything. <laughs> yes, we do. Yes, we do. If, if if we're with the person that we are truly in love with, I mean, dependent circumstances, okay? But yes, we do. Yes, we do. We, yes, we do. They just put it on the back burner temporarily and bring it up when it's convenient for them. No, uh, I don't agree. I don't agree. I'm not saying women don't. Don't do this. I'm not saying there's women who don't, but I don't agree. 
I don't know if really. There, there's a time in your relationship we just got to be mature and honest with something. If you can't forgive something, then you don't need to be there. Because then it, it playing in the back of your mind, it being there for ammo, that creates a whole nother problem. Did you forgive or not? If we're going to move on or not? So now nah, that's for that's for the immature women. That's for the younger women. Their argument. Number 10, I'm not jealous like other women. Most women are jealous like other women, but she wants you to think that she's different. I don't agree. I don't agree. I'm not a jealous woman at all. We just did a podcast on this, you guys. I need to go check that out, matter of fact. Link in the box. But, um, no, I'm territorial. What's mine is mine. <laughs> but I'm not a jealous person. Not at all. Number 11, I hope you had a good time. She doesn't hope you had a good time because it wasn't with her. Number 12. What type of hating shit is that? <laughs> what type of hating sentence is that? I want my man to go have a good time. If he be out with the bros, go have drinks at the bar, watch the game or whatever. I want him to have a good time. That is, oh my God. Now that's, that, that's bratty. That's bratty as hell. I don't, nah, I don't agree with that. Because it wasn't with her. Number 12, I promise I won't get angry. That means if it's not as bad as what I'm thinking, then it's okay. But if it is what I'm thinking, then I'm furious. Um, I can agree because you know what? We probably already mad <laughs> when we made that statement. So I got to get angry. I'm there already. Let's just see how far it's about to go once I, once I need you to tell me what I need you to tell me. So yeah, that, that is true. Number 13, my battery is dying. That means I seriously want to hang up in your face, but I'm giving you a warning first. Number 14, I've... It's been times my battery have died. Just get off the phone. <laughs> I don't understand all these excuses of, of, of getting off the phone, of not texting back or whatever. Just don't do it, you know? Just, I mean, especially if you're in a single stage or whatever the case may be, it's not like you got to, I mean, don't be rude or nothing, but you ain't have to, like, answer right when they do it, you know? If she has to say she moved on, then she hasn't, and it still bothers her. Number 15, your friend. If she has to say she moved on, I mean, I would feel like if you're dating somebody, that is something that person would want to know. So, I mean, if you got to keep repeating it, then nah. If she got to keep on repeating it, I moved on, I moved on, then probably not. But, I mean, that is something that, you know, especially if it's something traumatic happened in that relationship, that is something that your new person of interest would need to know. So, I don't agree because I say I moved on and I damn sure moved on to Green the past. Blank is handsome. That means I've already slept with blank mentally, and you better treat me right. Otherwise, I'll turn my dreams into reality. Whole mentality. I don't agree. Whole mentality. What the hell? You better treat me right. Otherwise, I'll huh, turn my dreams. Huh, hear what she just said. Blank is handsome. That means I've already slept with blank mentally, and you better treat me right. Otherwise, I'll turn my dreams into reality. No. Her mentality. You can you can compliment. First of all, I just I don't see myself ever telling my spouse that another man is handsome. It just I think I feel like that's weird. But do your own thing. You know what I'm saying? I compliment a female. You know, but that don't mean I'm mentally slept with the person. No, I think that's weird. I think that's kind of like horse behavior. Especially saying if you don't do this, then I'm gonna do this. That's daddy behavior. Number sixteen. I'll be ready in five minutes. That means she'll be ready in an hour. Number th That's a fact. That is a fact. It takes me an hour to do some hair and makeup. So that is a fact. Don't ever believe my five minutes. If I tell you five minutes, you know I'm lying. Off top, I, I agree. You deserve someone so much better than me. That means, yeah, I've lost interest in you. Number eight. That's a fact. <laughs> And no, I listen. I don't know why she's saying women just said because men say that shit too. Okay, that's a fact across the board. Baby, I ain't interested. I won't ever change you. I love you just the way you are. That means you're like putty in my hands and watch as I slowly but steadily manipulate you into what I want you to be without you even noticing. I'm gonna wind it back one more time before I even say my comment on that one slowly but steadily manipulate you into what I want you to be without you in my hands and watch uh, 
I won't ever change you. I love you just the way you are. That means you're like putty in my hands and watch as I slowly but steadily manipulate you into what I want you to be without you even noticing. I guess if you're, I I guess if you're a narcissist, you just... that may, you know, a narcissistic person, I can see that being. A normal person, nah. You're supposed to like a person for who they are. And then if whatever changes may happen, it's supposed to be willingly. So for a narcissistic person, I can see that being factual. I, I've experienced a narcissistic person before, so factual. You are. That means you're like putty in my hands and watch as I slowly but steadily manipulate you into what I want you to be without you even noticing. Number 19, I don't believe in checking my man's phone. Every single woman has checked a man's phone before. Lies. I will not check my man's phone. I don't want to. This is the thing. If I have to pick up your phone for like I got to check it, we done lost already. We done lost already. I am not picking up my man's phone and checking for nothing. Because I have complete trust. It's a trust thing. We don't already lost if I got to pick up your phone and look at it. I don't want to. I'm going to have to find out a different way. God going to have to just show me a different way. But it ain't going to be that one. Fellas, don't let these ladies lie to you. Number 20, I hate guys who play games. Girls love guys who play games. Number 20. Lies. Play with me and see what happens. <laughs> play with me and see what happens. Okay? You're going to be playing by your damn self. Sorry, wrong text. Do you know how hard it is to accidentally text someone? No. People get leaked all the damn time. I done sent wrong texts before. So that sorry wrong text might be the wrong text. But I mean, I've definitely seen people on some scam and shit like that, you know. I've seen that more on the guy side, though, not the female side. But she obviously different. She didn't text you by accident. She just wanted to remind you that she still exists. Number 22, I'm on my period or I have a headache when you try to attempt sex. She doesn't want it, but she doesn't want to say it, so she blames it on this. Number 23. Or she could really be on her period <laughs> or have a headache. But okay. I, I I don't see myself saying that in the excuse of not wanting to do it. I'm going to just tell you I don't want to do it. What we got to lie for? Sorry, I'm just really busy from now until forever. Hint, she's not busy. She's just too busy for you. Number 24, it's not you, it's me. Fashion. It's you, it's always you. Number 25, I just don't get along with <laughs> other you. girls. I don't it's know always why. you. They always know why. They just don't want to talk about it because they want to maintain their innocence. Number 26, I never wear makeup. Tinted moisturizer is still makeup, mama. But how is moisturizer makeup? It's moisturizer. You're not contouring anything. This is makeup, okay? I promise, I'm going to tell you something, for real, for real. I don't have eyebrows, okay? <laughs> for real, for real. I draw these shits on every time. Y'all see, I don't, like, I got this much eyebrows on each side. I'm, telling, I'm so serious. But moisturizer, girl, I mean, what you want to be dry? Like, what, what, what's going on? That is, that is definitely not makeup. Mascara, eyeshadow, eyeliner, lipstick, Makeup. Moisturizer, a daily routine that I would hope everybody's doing. I want you to think that they're naturally flawless. Number 27, I don't have any expectations. Almost all women have expectations, but she wants you to think Facts. that she's open-minded. Number 28, I'm a that. very simple woman. Women by nature are not simple creatures, but she doesn't want you to think that she's complicated because then that might scare you off. Number 30, I've Look, you got complicated women out here. Those are factual, and you got simple women out here. That's just factuals, okay? So, I mean, I can see that kind of going either or. With X amount of men. Almost always, that number is going to be a lie because they don't want you to get turned off because now you think that they're easy. Put down in the description box how many... I didn't hear that last one. My bad. Now you think that they're easy. Put down X amount of men. Almost always, that complicated because then that might scare you off. Number 30, I've only been with X amount of men. Almost always, that number is going to be a lie because they don't want you to get turned off because now you think that they're easy. But down in the description I'm going to say that's factual for females. But there you got some who are just who are just honest. It depends on the females. Some females do not mind telling their body count. And some females is just, they'll lie. It depends. So, 
and I, I've definitely uh, seen both. So, uh, I'm going to say 50-50 with that one. But um, y'all let me know how y'all feel about these 30 lies. You know what I'm saying? All, and all I'm saying is, ladies, since she spilled some of the beans on some of these lies, don't be, getting, don't be mad at her. Okay, I just, I just reacted to the video. I didn't spill the beans. But, um, that concludes this video. If you haven't already, please like and subscribe. Follow me on all social media platforms. Mm -hmm. That is she.chanel. And until we meet again, we are...